this is like a fork or something. Oh, ah. it's a box. This is a mystery item. Is this an old phone? Hey y'all, it's Emmy. Welcome back to another video. I'm really excited today because we're doing some magnet fishing. If you like what you see, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe. Now let's go get our magnet and walk up on the bridge. Oh no, Mr. Armadillo, he didn't make it. He didn't cross the road. What the heck? That's a big old that's, ranch. That's expensive right there. That's a lot of aluminum. We can get a couple things. Yeah, you do got so, something. Uh oh, uh -oh. I got some rebar in the house. Oh, this is some heavy rebar. Woo, we got the rebar. Oh, this is a long piece of rebar. Holy crap. I look at that. Woo. We're just gonna park our rebar right there. Oh, we got a really long piece of it. Hey, you know, you gotta get your daily piece of rebar and it looks like I got my daily piece of rebar with some extra length on it. So maybe this counts for a couple days. Oh, this is really heavy. Oh. You got something big? Yeah. I gotta reposition. Okay. Ugh. You got it. Ooh. Need some help? Yeah. Oh! Ah. It's a box? Oh no. It's a rebar damn. box. It's a piece of I beam and rebar. Oh, that is really heavy. Oh, I got a hand on it. Okay. Ooh. Oh, oh. oh, wow. <laughs> oh gosh. I'd say that was probably pretty heavy, Emmy. Got some I beam and rebar. Oh. There we go. <laughs> oh, it's a two for the I beam and the rebar. Dang, go. Holy crap, that was a heavy one. Yeah, that's hey, uh, pretty solid. It's right a there. magnet fishing stool, but we got a bunch of squiggly nails. Oy. Okay, my turn. I threw up. I threw up. Woo! Probably got my magnet off. I'm looking at it. I think it's just rebar and like bridge parts. So this is my second piece of rebar along with this I-beam looking thing right here. I was telling Bryce, it looks like a stool. So this is going to be my magnet fishing stool. Look at that. That's pretty cool. I can just take a little break, maybe eat a snack, or I could be the thinker. Magnet fishing. But we got a magnet fishing stool here. Pretty cool. I think my butt might be a little dirty. That's why we got the bibs on. I do have something on my magnet. I'm not really sure how, but I guess that's just the magic of this 360 magnet. Ugh, even when I'm bad at magnet fishing, the magnet's still good. Okay, we almost lost it though. Okay, oh, we got more rebar. Rebar, rebar, rebar. Ugh. We got shorter pieces of rebar. Maybe it's like salad. We got some chopsticks right up in here. We could eat some magnet fishing. Sushi did not work. And it. Woo, it's getting toasty in the sun. Ooh, ooh, oh, yes. Uh-oh, oh, we got it. I think we got it. Yeah, that's heavy though. I think it's just extra heavy because I am really tired right now. It's looking like part of a bed frame if I can just get it out of the way. Oh yeah. Whew. Yes, this is part of a bed frame with the wheels on it. We've got one wheel, got two wheels. Maybe you can find a whole bed, but I don't know why anyone would be throwing their bed in the water unless, you know, they had a floaty bed. And then we just got this weird type of wire all cut up in fishing line. Ooh. It's time to load up our scrap trailer. We're gonna throw right under yeah, that tree branch. Time. All right, I got something. Else. What do we got? It is. This is kind of a small creek of sorts. Not terribly big, but it is pretty deep here. What is this? Well, all right, we got all something we got shiny is a couple on nails. There. Got a couple things. We got just much. some junk. We got, we got some keyboard. right there, like a lot. I got something. Oh, let's get it. Okay. Man, this is a weird shape. Uh, I really don't know what this is. The more I look at it, it could be the shape of an E or maybe it's the side frame of an old sewing machine, like a singer. Come down and then you have a pedal and you have another one. That's my thought. And then, oh, is this an old phone? Or no, the more I look at it, I'm pretty sure it's just 
a fancy lock or a hinge to a door. I think there might be a lock. Wow, there's a bunch of goodies on that throw. So we got a bent nail, a little mushroom, and a mini donut right there. I and then this piece of metal, I don't know what that is. Junk right here. It feels like my magnet is clicking either along rocks or it's clicking on things. So it's kind of hard to tell right now. We're doing the magnet fishing. Oh, whoa, look at all those nails. Got a big old scrappy pine right there. I'm glad I got gloves on because I don't want to be poked from all these nails. Even look at that, it's like a triangle. This kind of looks like a tooth of an excavator or something. Put it in the bucket. Oof, there's something out there that my magnet's on. Not too sure if it's actually magnetic. Oh, let's get it past the pipe in the bridge. I don't want to catch another bridge today. Just some scrappy scrap goodies nails a weird thing like this again i don't know what this is but it's the second one that i found here at this spot it's really weird honestly and we got a square piece of metal it looks like a tortilla chip of sorts or it's a big saltine cracker Woo. sounds like there's a click on my magnet this spot is honestly super tricky because i don't know if it's going to be trees or actually metal goodies we got a couple goodies oh smoky goodies though those are really sharp oh my gosh that would really hurt if it went in my hand i've had it happen before in the past oh look at this we got a little magnet fishing ring Ooh, it barely fits look at that beautiful we're gonna put it in the bucket that is our first magnet fishing ring of the year Come on, magnet. Come on, magnet. Let's find some metal-y things. Ooh. It does look like we found some metal-y things. Wow. Bunch of scrappy scrap. You know, good old pretzel sticks or pokey sticks. This looks like it's part of a pipe or maybe a flashlight. The pip part of a can. And then just a metal. Solid piece of metal in the bucket. And just some more scrappy cornflakes. Even this weird looking bracket. Oh, it's like a little screw right there. Huh. I'm coming over. All right, we're just getting nailed. Oh no, a tree. Oopsie. So we did at least get a couple of happy with that. Woohoo, we're free from the tree. Sorry, Mr. Tree. Kind of threw my rope on top of you. It's kind of hot and cold today. Ooh, looks like we got a few things. Some brackets and screws. Oh, two spark plugs. Oh, wow. I had to go back to my bucket because I left it. But we got one spark plug right there. And then a second spark plug that's super magnetic right now. But it looks like we got a little, is this an energy log? Oh, no, it's a bullet casing, not an energy log. And then some scrap goodies. Some type of bracket with an eye bolt right there. And then another spark plug. Cool. This spot had a few little goodies in it. I'll take it. Now we're going to head to another bridge. I don't know what this spot is, but is that the creek right there? Or is it down there? This is looking more like a creek. Way bigger than that one down there. So let's get hooked up. I just got to watch out for those tree branches and then I'll be good. Let's take a throw. I like having this side all to myself. More chances to catch stuff. But I gotta do, gotta watch out for the logs. <clears throat> I might have to take off my bibs and my sweatshirt in a little bit. It is getting warmer. Let's try again. I think maybe a bit of a farther throw this time. We're just gonna kinda ease our magnet back to us instead of pulling it back fast. Ooh. That is a snap on. Oh, that is definitely a snap. It's like directly under me. Holy cow. I wonder if it's just a pipe because I don't feel it anymore. So I click back on the thing that's directly below me. Oh, what? Oh, okay, man. Oh. Oh. Gavin, across the street. Gun to you too. Man. Dang, man. I was just saying we're getting ready to go and Gavin pulls a gun out of Ooh. nowhere. No magazine. Is it gold plated? Brass. Was it? Brass. Oh, no. Looks here. There you go. Look at that. Gavin got one. Hey. Well, that's really cool. Gavin just found a gun 
and it looked like it was brass plated and I just found a bunch of nails. So we're gonna turn this day around. Maybe I can find myself a gun. Oh, let's... Ooh, yeah, there's something tugging on my magnet. I just gotta drag this thing back in. Ooh, ooh okay, whoa, let's throw it back on. My magnet was definitely on something, but it was stuck in the mud. I saw it come just slightly to the surface. It almost broke the surface, but it didn't work out this time. So we're gonna try again. Yeah, sat right there. Ooh, my magnet's way heavier. Let's just go steady and slow. Oh no. I have a tree, but it looks like I also have some metal. So let's see if I can lose this tree stick, not lose my magnet fishing fine. What the heck? It looks like I have a whole tree. Is the tree tied to this metal? Oh my gosh, this is nuts. I literally have a signpost, but it's stuck to a tree. Oh, okay, there we go. We got it. My magnet did not want to let it go. Piece of metal. This looks like it was a signpost, but it's kind of bent now. So we're just gonna put it in our bucket. Fits perfect. That will definitely fit in the trailer, no problem. Yeah, there's some stuff. You gotta kind of go slow. Oh, that's weird. Ugh, it's heavy though. Okay, let's get it. This is a mystery item. Oh, that is so weird. So I'm looking at this and is it like crumpled up chain or something? Or is it a can? I'm gonna ask Bryce. Do you know what this is? Uh, no. I don't know what that is. That's okay, weird. so this is a mystery item. If you know what this is, this is our mystery item. No clue what it is. I'm gonna put it in the bucket. Whoa, what is this thing? It's like silver on the bottom. Car part? Let me see. I thought it was a Yeah, it's a, I think it's a muffler. Oh, wow. That must be full of water. Yeah. Bryce got a muffler. Oh! Dang, Look at him. He got it. Got I gotta like, ask no. Bryce if that was like right here. Because if but... that was the thing I was clicking on, we'll take it, I just man. must have Let's not been able to get it. Because then I'll just stop trying. Yeah. Bryce, where'd you find that? Like right here? Yeah, I thought it was a stick. Over there? Yeah. Did you come across this at all? Because I don't feel it anymore. So maybe that weird mystery item I found earlier was a car part. It was so smashed to hell and back. Okay, looks like there's a few things on our magnet. Must have been right below me. We got this little um, hook screw thing. Not sure why it's designed like that or what purpose, but in the bucket. And then, oh, there we go. It looks like it's a gear of sorts or a really thick magnet fishing donut. I'm gonna put it in the bucket. Ooh. Oh, oh, I'm in the bushes. Oh, it was swinging. I can't hit the bridge. Oh, oh, we got it. It's a very weird pipe looking thing, but Bryce says it's some type of car part. I think it goes so. to components over there, to oh. all that stuff that I was getting. Yeah, it looks super matchy. I, something. This is good. I believe Bryce and I are solving a mystery. They took it for a joyride and then they were like, chop, chop. Threw my magnet right beside the bank to see if there's any stuff. Ooh, we still got some. Magnet fishing goodies. Woo -hoo -hoo. Let's go. It looks like it's some really old, crusty. Woo! That magnet did not want to let go of these vines. So it looks like it's old, crusty metal pipes of sorts because it has that look to it. I don't know what this is actually called, but it just has that metal pipe look. I'm gonna throw it in the bucket. Ooh, I think we got movement. Oh, we got a big old fish on the rope. Uh oh, I think it fell off. Oh no, oh, I still have something though. Oh man, all my emotions. Uh oh, uh oh, oh no. This is the lid of a 50 gallon barrel. Oh gosh, that's typically not a good sign. I haven't heard any stories of this area um, burying bodies in 50 gallon barrels, but I never like seeing a 50 gallon barrel because Right when I see it, I'm like, oh no, I don't want to find a body of anything. That also explains where I'm getting all these cornflakes because it just boops, breaks off just like that. Whatever Gavin's messing with really is causing a lot of oil. A oh, what in the world? This is kind of scary looking. Oh, I almost lost it. Okay. Oh, what the heck? It's like falling apart in my hands. Let's see if I can get it off. Oh. I was honestly really scared of smashing my fingers. I don't know why I did that. I should have just stepped on it. My guess is an oil filter for a car. It's just having that look, you know? Ooh, I just heard a snap. 
Oh, this is weird. Uh, has anyone ever found this magnet fishing where it's a nail, but there's either concrete corroded rocks on it? I gotta do the Dairy Queen blizzard test. It's good, it's not falling off. In the bucket it goes. I gotta take off my sweatshirt. So we gotta unzip, get your gloves off. Oh boy, it is toasty today. My hair, this is not smooth at all. We are sweatshirt free. I'm keeping my bibs on because they're keeping me nice and dry from the wet water. Because water is wet. We're gonna strap y'all on back to my chest so y'all can see what I'm finding. Ha -ha. We're gonna do a two hand throw. Swing magnet swing. Ooh, that was a big old splash. Ooh, ooh. Oh gosh. I got a piece of it. Just some corn flake falling apart in my hand. I click on something big and then I'm pretty sure it's running into something so I'm not able to get it. There's actually like techniques and slight skill to magnet fishing, which is honestly very surprising. We just got to another bridge. If it's good, we'll just take a throw. Well, right now it's feeling a little soft. Ooh. Okay. This looks a little sharp and deadly. We got it! A Bud Light top of a glass jar. So it looks like this must have been busted open. Like they just threw the whole thing in and they didn't even get the gulp of the Bud Light. But that's an old design, so this has to be hecka old. Here's another Bud Light bottle cap. Oh, what's this? This is like a white pipe or something? But it looks so plasticky. Oh! Is this like the pole you stick into an umbrella used for the beach? But we're not even near the beach, so who knows? Well, we found some good things at this bridge, but it's time to head to another spot. So let's go do some bridge shopping. Well, our first throw is not empty. It looks like a nail or a kickstand, nothing much. I am worried about logs though. Oh, it's so cold. I've been on top of my guesses. What you got, Emmy? I, mean, I see your Feels magnet. like it's sliding. Looks like I'm stuck on the lip of something. Ooh, it's just getting heavier. It looks like a lamp. Or a back of a bench, maybe. Holy you really get it? frick! Can you really get it? It's literally stuck on a lip. Alright, just let it be. I'll get it. Let go? No, don't let go. Oh my gosh! It's not even all the way out of the water either. See? It was like a bounce. It was bouncing on. Yeah. Maybe. It was just super heavy. Just part of a some some type of metal right there. Are you trying to get it? I'm bummed I lost that flat piece of metal, but it was really just dangling on. I just hooked that lip of it. Oh jeez. <laughs> Well, I didn't get it, but I got a couple other things what straight down. I don't know what this. Oh, tables? it's a stapler! Look oh. at that! Oh, you got it! Oh, oh my goodness! Hey, at least we're getting. Oh, yo, this is like a fork or something. Is it a fork? Uh, that thing. Man, all this stuff is so freaking old. Man, someone was robbed her grandma's house and just stole all her kitchenware. And then we just got a solid so piece of metal. Kind of looks like a magnet fishing like toast the right there. We got some magnet fishing toast right here. Gobble, gobble. Yum. It gets to go in the bucket. Um, I definitely did not eat breakfast before I came out magnet fishing. So I'm getting really hungry. Sorry for all the food references. Oops. Well, got two little nails or some chopsticks right there. It looks like this bridge is built in 1998, so it's one year older than me. Dang. A nice little foothold right here. Let's throw this thing in. Feels like my magnet clicked on something. Ooh, the weight is still the same. Okay. Oh no, it was a stick. Ah, oh, it was a big old stick that I was moving around. That's annoying, but I did get this little spaghetti piece of metal. Dang, someone found something good magnet fishing, but should have picked it up. 
That's one way to have your internet cable go across the bridge. Ooh, getting a lot of bubbles. I hope this is something, not just a tree. Let's get out of the crack of the bridge. Ooh. Oh yeah, this is definitely metal. Oh, it's spinning. Ooh. Oh yeah, some mud fell out. Let's get it. Ooh. Okay. Ooh. Ooh. Boy, that was heavy. Looks like it's some type of gear full of mud. Pull that out. Grody. My guess it's some gear. Maybe there's little looking like blades or something in it. Whew, it's heavy though. I'm not exactly sure what it is, but this is a side view of it. So we got some blade looking things and then this and then the gear part. If y'all, if you have any idea what this is, let me know. It gets to go. Oh, that fits pretty good in the bucket. I was kind of worried that there wouldn't be any stuff at this spot because when we walked up, there's some magnet fishing scrap stuff that looks like some pe other people had been here. Ooh, magnet feels definitely heavier. Oh, whoa. This one's weird. What is this? Oh my gosh. It's just a bunch of screws. Oh, and glass apparently. Part of a glass bottle. We're gonna put that in the bucket immediately so I don't step on it and go through my But Just a bunch of screws, all different lengths. Earlier I was finding nails and now I'm just finding a scrappy pine of screws. Holy cow, just like, what the heck? A whole, it must have been a whole box of screws someone lost. I wanna be here for a little bit just getting all these screws off. But if you had this many screws, what would you do with them? I just got all the screws I could ever want in life. It feels like it's 50 screws on my magnet. And it was weird because it was kind of under the water grass too. And one hour later, our magnet is finally clean of screws. I'm gonna throw away from the screws because I do not want to spend another five minutes that felt like getting all those screws off. I'm just trying to hear a click. That feels like a hefty, ooh -y. Oh yeah. Oh, look at that bridge done. Or is that a bagel? I don't know. It could be one of the two. I did just eat before this, so it doesn't matter if I have eaten food or have not. We still make food references. Ball magnet fishing. Oh, it's fishing line. Okay. So my magnet just caught some fishing line. So we're just gonna pull on it and see if whatever is at the end of it I can get out. Ooh. Oh, oh, we got movement. We got movement. We're getting this fishing line out. Oh, it's a stick. Man, sticks are an enemy when it comes to magnet fishing. They just get all caught and stuff. And if you're regular fishing, sticks are no fun. Bunch of fishing line. Get it out of the water. It's a lucky catch because it's not even metally. Ooh, it's kind of getting chilly now. So I was finding stuff right off the bat at this bridge and now I'm kind of at a dry spell. I think I'm gonna go over to the other side. Look both ways. Crossy, crossy, cross, 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 cross. Ugh. Oh, this is a little suspicious. There's rope tied down under the water. Gonna take a shot from that. Bryce, there's this rope going down in the water. Is it a full size rope? It's this little flat rope. It's heavy at the end. Yeah. What if it's on this trap? Oh wait, it's not heavy. Oh, this looks like it's been down there for a minute. Uh oh. I think it's nothing. This is so weird. Well, just a mystery rope. I don't know what this was, but it's just a mystery rope. Nothing at the end of it. And it was just tied to the bridge. So I'm just going to tuck it right there. That is weird. So weird. Oh, I just saw a turtle come up to the water. But I had something. <laughs> I got a pipe. Look at that. Just a little, a little piece of pipe. And then we got a little mushroom nail right there. Should have brought a bucket over. It'll just make a little pile right there. Come back for it. 
with our bucket. Oh, getting some bubbles. Oh, oh, I'm coming up all in there. I'm doubled up. Oh. Bryce has something and I have something. Oh, oh look at that. Watch. Well, Bryce just lost his stop sign, but I got my thing. Two full shotgun shells, they're different sizes. We got a Nitro Turkey 1362 4 Remington. And then we got a Express 9 Pell 00 BK Remington. Different type of shotgun shells, both full. Bummer they didn't get used. Oh yeah, it's that like microphone speaker thing. This is really cool. It's like a speaker system. Oh, an ATW. Wires red, wearable, yellow, white, china, a 30 watt 614. It's like, burr, burr, burr. we are magnet fishing out here on this bridge. Bryce is having a terribly hard time with this stop shine. Ooh, okay. Well, oh, and we got a tiny little silver fishing hook right after the two things we got before. This one's looking really fresh and shiny. I'm gonna just clean up this stuff. So someone went magnet fishing here. They just didn't take care of their stuff. So if you go magnet fishing, just make sure you um, get rid of your stuff. This looks like some like maybe keys to something. That's kind of cool. Oh, but just if you go magnet fishing, make sure you clean up your scrap metal because if you leave it here, it just kind of clutters it. Well, this is gonna wrap up our video. We did lots of magnet fishing and bridge shopping, but we found a bunch of stuff and I'm really happy with it. So I'll catch y'all in the next video. Bye!